Hello everyone. Today I'm going to share with you what I did early um, in the morning actually. Let me turn on my lights it's kind of dark. There you go. Well, uh, today I hang up my quilt. As you can see behind me here. Yeah, it takes me a while to hang it up actually because uh, I kind of... Uh, I'm going to lower this uh, music. Um, because I wasn't sure on how to actually put that rod up there. Uh, on how to actually put the rod up there because it's um, this actually is a is a drywall you can see so I need to find the studs to do it I mean to put my um, my rod up there you see there so anyway I put it up um, on the start so yeah this is my quilt I made this quilt myself and I sent it uh, to a long arm quilter to to really quilt it so that um, you know because this is kind of big uh, it's a lap size I think about 52 inches wide and I'm not so sure how long it is but yeah so I don't have the machine to actually quilt it myself so anyway yeah this is my quilt I hang it during the daytime I mean in the morning it takes me a few well it's not a few hours just that um, I have to do something at the back of this quilt because in order for it to be hanged, you see I got to put something at the back so that um, it wasn't there before so it takes, uh, I use a hand uh, sewn, I have to hand sewn it so yeah and as you can see I'm happy with it I'm one happy camper and this is actually my living room I somehow um, changed the orientation of my my sofa and everything so that I have a, a space here to do my yoga so I like I like to play sometimes uh, by doing handstand headstand whatever it is crow pose so I just like to play so I need I need a space um, for uh, to do my yoga so when I fall at least I don't uh, hurt myself anymore so yeah and that is my um, yoga stuff and other weights for my weight training and I like this slider if you want to do um, uh, it is good for core work because I have a carpet so and um, so I use this slider to do my core work to help me with the core because most of the handstand headstand and crow pose requires and other asanas requires core work and I'm not strong in my core so I have to do that and yeah so and today I just like to share with you this one. and today I'm going to um, I'm not I'm going to but I'm, I'm making a what is it called like gumbo but it's not really it's more like a rice I put it in a wok and I just put everything inside it and let it cook so anyway here's how it looks like this is brown rice let me use my it's kind of hot. This is brown rice. It's still cooking at low heat. Um, and there's chicken. There's a lot of uh, vegetable inside it. And it's already cooked. I think the rice really cooked. But I cook it at low heat. So, yeah. Uh, brown rice is very tricky. So, better lower it down a little bit so that it won't burn. Um, it's very tricky. You have to... Uh, if you use... If you want to cook brown rice... To make it not gritty, you have to do this equivalent, like one cup of rice, no, yeah, one cup of rice equals to two cups of water. So if you put less cup of water, um, your rice won't cook properly and it will turn bad. Not, not really bad, but uh, you will have that gritty kind of taste and you won't like it. It's because it's not really cooked, so... The light is kind of bright here. Um, anyway, that's what it is. So if you have, if you want to use one cup of rice, use two cups of uh, water. Or one cup of rice and one and three quarter, is it three quarter, a little bit higher? Yeah, one and three quarter cups of water so that your rice will cook properly. Yeah, and um, basically that's it. I'm not baking today because I'm too tired of baking bread. So, because I've been playing and listening to my music, you know what music I like? I like to listen to We Were Us, I think from Keith Urban and uh, Miranda, 
Lambert. Yeah, I like I like to do that and I like to goofing on once once in a while at my own home in my um here in my living room because it's so spacious. Yeah, I, I just felt that I need to organize it to make it more spacious and not so crowded. I'm trying to uh use this uh what do you call it thing um what's the word like um the less is more so yeah so kind of um good thing any anyway yeah that's it for today and you yeah, have a great holiday tomorrow i guess uh martha luther king gave but i have to go to work but anyway yeah and yeah good night bye